I assume now you've noticed the the difference between a actual throwing dagger and a normal dagger. The weightedness of it and such. Um. Yes, actually. Mhm. Mm a good way to test if uh, a dagger is good enough for throwing, and when you test its balance, is if you take the dagger and you try to balance it on your finger. As long as you have the balance point slightly below the hilt, you can use it for throwing pretty well. It can be fucking massive, oh. but as long as it's balanced like that, you should be able to get the rotations correct. Obviously, you need to put more welly into it, but, you know. I think I could manage to do that. <laughs> that you could. One of the bathhouse workers apparently heard a rumor. Go on. The embassy's fallen. Fallen or given to someone else? Given was definitely not the word. Oh. I doubt my father would have fallen that early. Yes. She got on a boat and fucked off. Well, shit. Yep. Unless you want to be skewered by this knife, I will not stand over there. He's threatening you! I'm trying to get my crack. Kyler, Kyler, he's bullying me. Arrest him. Good, you deserve it sometimes. Oh, God. Yeah. We got through three patrols. More muscling. Am I wrong? No. Or stretched thin. Boy. Boy. Do I have a deal for you? What's going on? Uh, Eleven additional iron ore and three iron ingots. Ooh, okay. You know, that. Practice this as well. Practice what? Come on, try and help him find the guards. Guards. Throw knives. That's sympathetic to the bear. How many ingots? He was the last day that I needed. Oh. Three. Okay. What the fuck am I hearing? Throwing knives and somebody got murdered? I don't get it. Lots of rumors going around. Such as? Apparently the embassy's fallen, but... Rumors like that would only cause panic. I know that to what not be true. From that? Then squash them. <laughs> If you hear a negative rumor, don't just let it spread. Squash it. Especially in times like these, we can't have people panic. <sighs> so... You happen to want to happen to talk to one of the sergeants, have you? Which one? 
you the one to do the watch? <sighs> Not yet, though I did talk to uh, Marcus and he's going to try and uh, reinforce it. No, uh, give me your hand. He just gave you a cross guard and a pommel. Understood. I will start work on that now. It adds nothing but sentimental value to the new sword. Okay. A two handed steel iron sword. Is steel iron. Steel sword. I am really tired. It's 15 copper normally, but you're providing pretty much all the steel. So, could call it five. Never expected one like you would be using one. Let's call it eight. Give you some money. Fair enough. I'll take it. I don't really have a good answer. Thank you. How are you strapped on coin? I'm actually really good. Okay then. In that case, I'll just keep the rest of my money, just in case. In that case, you could use javelins. Lord Earnhardt, crossbow. Mm -hmm. it's here to see you. One moment. I think you want to look to your left. Uh, yes, sir. I need to see the blacksmith, but I think things are important now. Um. <clears throat> I'm going to go to the alchemist shop and get some glimmer or she's in no pain. Yeah. I believe so. And it's not a dream. <laughs> I'll be right back. I'll be right back, Tango, and go get that glimmer down to the uh, storage. A bit of a reunion. You got it. You're okay. How's your shoulder, by the way? Somewhat. Yeah. Doing the javelin. good. The javelin? <laughs> good. Ow. Sorry. Happened? I had no look left. You better be ready for a lot of hugs. Oh, the javelin. Oh, she got hit by something yesterday. I see. Is Robber Baron Men. I told you I'd come back. I got hit by a boulder. Just Robber Baron Men. I heard you got buried. Well, just Robber Baron Men when they pushed all the way up yeah, near the rock. The they mill. pushed the boulder down, hit had to make a choice. Sitting in. Yeah. Maybe it opened your eyes. I'm sorry, I'm driving a cart. Y'all in the front. Open your eyes. Let's <laughs> get you inside somewhere. I can barely stand. Come on. I will see the terrain if there is there. It's not just a valley with rocks. Oh. Tell everybody to come back in a few minutes. Apparently you have business. Hello, Easy now. I'm sorry. I got what she needs. Uh, may I step in and get it prepared? Or... Go for it. Don't worry, I'll get it ready for you. Alright. Just brought her in town a few minutes ago. I'll let her get cleaned up before I brought her over. You said the potion seller brought me back. 
water, Marcus. Oh, yeah, he's the one that ki- he's, Of course. He's the one that he's the one that came to the grove with the wagon. I see. He just he just said, looking ba in the back, basically, as a gesture. Fuck, I am. Sorry, <laughs> hold on oh one God. second. I don't know where the fuck I am. This is wondrous we news. Welcome, welcome. Hello, Marcus. Hello, hello, Sarah. It's great to see you. You too. <clears throat> <sighs> what happened? Um, they were pushing us back. He was going to kill us. Arundel tried, and he was thrown aside. Cade tried, and he was thrown aside. I destroy everything I touch, so I decided to destroy him. And it worked. Finally, it worked in my favor. It did what I wanted it to do. And I woke up in the grove. I don't. An opening. Oh, milady. Moses. Um, lady. Come on, we have business now. Yes, ma. Yes, my lady. Not uh, you. There's the gun. Oh, oh. Um, I promise I'll be here when you get back. Your orders. Keep her safe. Sure. You know, actually, since you're here, I do have something I need from you. Mm. Of course Potions. Three. Maybe. Three, okay. Something to calm the minds. Oh. Seems that, oh. um, some people are having issues. Three. Hear me? Mm. I asked if you're ready for fun. Sure. <laughs> Currently sitting in my quarters in the keep is a group of nobles. Here to speak with you. Don't thank me. Not yet. You can use them. Figure out where everyone's mind is, hmm? Where are these nobles based? And I'm sh- And who are they? All of them, hmm. All of them are from Notis. At least currently. If we want things, if we intend to make any sort of standing, we need them. And you need to change. Fix yourself. <sighs> Sitting in there like that isn't going to solve anything. You need to be up there. Speaking to the people who matter right now. The ones who can actually make a difference because of what's in their pocket. Lead the way. Hmm. You're actually going to wear that. We are at war, but if you want me to change... You are dealing with stuck-up noble assholes. The words are cold, but ring true. There's plenty on your mind, and this is just one more thing to the pile, but there is a bit to what she said that makes sense. The people up... 
That's the last thing I remember feeling was ripping apart. Oh god. I was made of sins. My poor hands. Ah, he, he, yeah, I can make you a, um, a pastel do salve. It's a chlorine salve. Treat severe burns and chemical burns. It's like it uses eight and promotes healing, so. It doesn't burn, it just hurts. Your mind flips to the conversations you had at Cassetto. Stretch. Well, the idea of having to entertain people like that again... It bothers you. It might be like what but you have a task, like both inside and out, and, and there's no one else who can do it. Skin. It takes a while for it to adjust. Likely. Uh, safe travels. Better. <sighs> With the dad in the state that he's in, you need to build a reputation. Beyond just someone who's out there fighting a battle that's been started. If he doesn't come back, and you have no standing, you lose, ev lose everything he's fought for. If he doesn't come back, we lose Nautus. So be it. Mm. What can they offer us? I see. Why are they so I'm important? Each of them has their own thing. Their car. Not... Jahir, he's a gladiator owner. He's second to myself in the town. The whole group of them have their own yeah. slaves. I'm trying to avoid you might be able to use them as fighters. Private contracts. I'm focusing more on the Contracts involving the Redolds. Tariq. Sixty or so in total. Between the lot. Hmm. Here. At least for now. I'll try. Are we really that desperate? I'm sorry, have you not seen how close they are to our city? Mm-hmm. Have you not seen our numbers dwindle? Do you really think they'll give up their only assets? Mm. And that's where you come in. Convince them. Do you know the way it works? Go on. <laughs> you give something in turn. Yeah, Most of them won't be agreeable without that. Mm. And you make... Mm. You make deals. You may not have it now, but you might later. And that says a lot. I already pledged a lot of things to the people in Corsetto. That was supposed to help us, and look where we are now. Corsetto isn't here. These people are in front of you. These people in Corsetto were supposed to bring their things here. Are you going to take my heed or not? I'm hearing it. I don't see how they're going to help us, though. Sixty men. Who actually know how to fight. Beyond just putting on a show. Fighting with Do you slaves. not think that has any worth or standing? Slaves are not. We are desperate. What do you think that is going to happen to them if the robber baron takes over? Do you think they're going to be set free? All points you could make to them. I don't know why I'm here handling this. You're more of a slave person than I am. Do you... I said I would give you my help, did I not? Mm-hmm. Am I supposed to just hand it over to you, do all the work for you? What I'm saying is we're dealing with people that want to give up their slaves, and you are, as you said, the top person in slaves in this city. In fact, the only person we're talking to here is second to you, as you said. 
So wouldn't they give your word more no. wa yeah. weight than mine? There's five in total. Forgive me for stopping in front of the Imperials. <laughs> Allow me to finish. Hmm. Jahir is the first. Second in Montes. <sighs> Most of his fighters are melee. Close range. Uthroli. Has about a dozen or so. At least good ones. The rest of them are shit. He won't want them. He might actually be on your side. From everything he's been talking about, we need to take care of the city. Use him. Make sure he is on your side first. He might stand with you quicker than the others. <sighs> he might want more, though. Land. Something like that. Anything we can offer him. You have to be able to throw these men and women a bone. I don't have land to offer these people. I don't have anything. <sighs> Not now, but when the battle is done. The point is... You don't say you can, say you'll try. Having them on your side is better than not. Once again... If your father does not come back... And you want to keep that status? And make sure the Imperials are off your ass? And everyone else's? That is who you need to convince to be on your side. Not me. My standing only goes so far. Because you will be on your own. We will be on our own. Do you hear me? Mm -hmm. <sighs> Tarantella. Range fighters. Good raiders. At least they could be used that way. <sighs> She's against the idea, but... You might be able to give something there, too. If payment comes into play, I might be able to help. A little. I'm stretched thin as it is, paying for mercenaries. <sighs> Who else? Oh. Oh. I think the old woman's in there, too. Bigoli? She's sweet. Tough. But sweet. Might be able to get her, too. And the problem child. <laughs> the Sahib. He hates me. I may or may not recently have fucked him over out of a slave. He wanted to throw a fight, and well... I don't do that. I had to show him. But he does have a great number on his side. The demands are going to be high, I'm sure. But if you can't even handle this bunch... ...when we have to leave this city and make negotiations... <laughs> ...you're screwed. Business. I have a meeting in my own quarters. Very well, milady. My lord. Consider it proof. You can handle yourself outside of the battlefield, hmm? Because you're needed for more than that. Whatever she wants. There's a meeting fight. We hear the son of Lord Erhon. We got hmm. something at home. No issues. Ah. I'll keep an open mind. Okay, <laughs> you're a fucking exploration. Already running their mouths. Of course you can. <sighs> we will see, regardless. But hopefully this will Would you step aside and time. allow me back in? <laughs> Forgive me for keeping all of you waiting. The young lord is quite busy. 
You have some fucking nerve summoning me after what you've done, Nozos. <laughs> Calm yourself. It is not for me. A young lord which is, wishes hmm. to speak with you. Hmm? Hmm. I am only the so one who gathers. you are the son <clears throat> of Lord Erdhart. I am. Pleasure. The one responsible for us losing the war. Is that what you've heard? Yes, I've heard those rumors too. I'll make this as brief as I can. I'm sure you will have places to be and things to do. In case you haven't realized it, without the Imperial support, we are losing this war. We need fighters. You have fighters. That's the gist of it. <laughs> there it is. <sighs> uh, it's not some surprising. The different nobles look like amongst each other in the room, some whispering, some looking more alarmed than the others, and a couple looking like they expected it. A diverse group in the room, to be sure, all with their own machinations. All who have things you need. So, let's be constructive and see how we can help each other out. Any objections to this? And we'll talk it out. Yes, clearly. And you are? Obviously, I am Yahir. Yahir? I own some of the most in the quantity of slaves and fighters. And I can tell you one bit, I am not forces. It's not to be, I doubt to get much gain from it if I am sending my best, my warriors, all of them, for Adrian, whatever endeavor this is with the war. Oh, it's not aiding me, it's aiding the city, I'd point out. Need I remind you what happens if we lose this war and we lose the city? Do you think any of you will still have a lordship? Or slaves? Where are you sending our boys, uh, exactly? That depends on numbers and what you could offer me. Mm. You would be Regoli, correct? I am Mama Gregolo, yes. Pleasure. Hi, you are purple, my favorite color. Mm. <laughs> Thank you. Very nice. Yes. To answer your question, it would depend on how many fighters we could get and what sort of fighters we could get. Obviously, we don't want to just send these people out to die. We want to use them and win. That's the whole point of this, after I all. I would rather choose where my boys, you know, die and when they die, and I'd rather not <laughs> willy-nilly set them out to battle, you know. Of course not. I am like a, f a farmer and they are He's my flock. I care about my mm. boy. He's a good young man. Mm. Takes after his father. I'm glad. No. I yes. believe his work They too. mean a lot to me, Sam. I have had since boys. Him, if you so, you can understand. Mm. <laughs> eh. willing to put Orc Spain as a I do not want them going out just to... I would like, you know, as well, yes. to not uh, lose my, my work. Of course, and we wouldn't want to do that Maybe either. While it, it may be true that slave trade is a big thing in Gradia, I've always seen them as people rather than objects. I don't want to sell their lives just for... To gain, I don't know, meters mm. of land or something like that. They'd be involved in specific actions, Mama of course. Mama is quite a good judge of character, I'm sure. Mm. Mama also has a habit of patting people with her stick for no reason. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Ash your gums. Oh, I'm sure they deserve it, Listen to the boy. Uh. Mm. So what are you going to offer for the boys, like eh? Well, she says this, it seems like she's willing to listen. And you've already heard from what some of the other nobles say that her sway is incredibly important. <clears throat> your pitch likely begins now. Well, it would depend on what you want. I can't make huge promises right now, as we are obviously at war and our back is against the wall. But, once the war is finished, and we win, with your help, your rewards would be something we could work out, I'm sure. What I want the most, you cannot exactly give me but a coin. Coin sounds very good to me. 
and how much. Hmm. The Radads never pay. I'm not asking Anyone the Radads. Anyone who hmm. Nozos has even less credit. Hmm. Your word means <sighs> nothing. I'll get to you. We need something immediate. How much coin? It does make a good point. Would you be requesting for Would it be up front? Depends on the coin. My f I usually sell my best fighter for one gold each. That's a bit steep, even for me. Mm. But if we are sending our best boys for your war, hmm? Hey. There seems to be a uh, term being thrown around that this is my war. Not the case. I mean, it, is the and... it is our war. Unfortunately, we are lords, and the lords' duty are to their people, despite what some people may think. That means our duty is to Nautus and the people in there. Slaves, not slaves. It doesn't matter. We're at war, and that's the end of it. And we are lords, and we back our lord and our barons. That is our duty. To think we would Rolling, have any sort Tyler. of standing. I do wonder. Had advantage. Mm. At first, with the beginning of your words, with a four, it doesn't seem like they care much about honor, much like those at Cassetto. However, as you bring up the terms duty and that they're to be loyal to their lord, a couple of them look between each other. They're starting to reassess your character. Mm. You're making it very clear that you have a particular perception, and now they're wondering if they could get in deep shit if they don't apply themselves to the 14. You're not sure. Things have not been won over yet, but they're on notice. If we lose this war, because we don't pull our weight as lords, none of us come out on top. We lose our lordship. You probably lose a lot of your slaves regardless. Because when the fighting starts and they get through the gates because we haven't been able to fight them in the field, that's it. That's game over. Now, if we win this war without the help of the lords, then that doesn't look good either. Does it? If we win this, brings into question... Well, what's the point of having all these lords if they don't sit, if they don't assist us when our chips are down, when our backs are against the wall? Who came to our aid? Now, my father is right there on the front lines. Hmm. The people at Cosetto had to be bribed and threatened to show that they even cared. Now, that's their reputation, and that's going around. My question is, do you want to assist us? and be a part of, well, who came to our aid when we needed it? Whose fighters were instrumental to this war? Because it sure as shit is in the Imperium right now. Something to think With about. With all due respect, Lord Erdhart, why is it you keep waving around the accomplishments of your father like you've earned them yourself? I have fought alongside my father on most of his battles. When he is out there, I'm in here. Is that why he is the one on the front line? And if, you are here? And you're here? If I could switch our places, I would. He chose not to, though. Hmm. Hey. Let the boy speak. We should respect fellow lords. Hmm? And also Thank you, my lady. Did you know he is my favorite? <laughs> Very well, Mama. While my father well. was bedridden in a coma, I saw to the front lines. When he returned, we switched places again. I don't claim to hold my father's accolades as my own, but it's more about a family's reputation, passed on through blood, passed on through experience. You understand dynasty, then? I do. 
do you understand? Humans, eh? I've been around them my entire life. In fact, I was born in Gradio, believe it or not. Hmm. Hmm. I was born in Coracatus originally. I have seen the lowest of the lows, and now I stand upon the highest of the highs. I've seen it all. Hmm. Hmm. I see. Mm. Some of us you know how will to recognize make your way up in the world. There's a need for fighters. Very good. Let's say I have about a dozen good fighters. Mm. Mm. I'm not interested in coin alone. Mind you, I have other things. Land, or a title, or perhaps both. You're not a lord already. Mm. I am, Most but having merchants. more sway. Mm. I'd be a low lord in a sense. Well, I can't make the promise on behalf of the Redods, but I can speak. to garner some favor on your behalf if of course we win this war and if of course these fighters are <laughs> instrumental enough which i hope they will be assuming we have enough men mm -hmm. you've mentioned the talk of dynasty we need something immediate we can't just rely on promises for the future. We or you? Is there anything you can offer us currently? Us or you? Do you have anything but your word, but air? It would be us. Yeah. Yes. To decide it. Very well. Hmm. As for I've... our loss, we need a game. Yes. Hmm. As I've talked to you individually, I'm gaining more of a picture on the things that you would like. Coin, land, or a title. Mm. I would like more than... I won't need a title or a land. More of an apology during the... Uh, how can I say this? During the journalist air time? I would like an apology for that. My family name been thrown through the mud, and there have been many of families that I've known that partake in such things. I can do... I know for a fact that Jodar has punished me and my family for something we do not know, nor did. Hmm. I can offer you an apology on behalf, or I can offer you a chance. I want it from the sons, not from you. I can offer you a chance to redeem your family. If you want my men, my toys, I'm going to need it. Not sooner, not later, but mostly sooner. Okay, I've established what you want. Mm. I will be blunt with my desires. Please. Since I have many under my supervision, if I were to send them out to fight, there's a good chance that I may lose most of them. So, while they prefer coin, while they prefer titles, apologies, I want guarantees that not only that my Could number of fighters will be replenished, but I will also gain more. You know as well as I do. I need this word means jack shit, mm. especially so, since you are the one sponsor. For every loss, I expect I to be replaced with two. Father, originally, it is the Baron who sees sight in them now. And why is the Baron not here and you? Oh. I believe that is a fair compensation. I believe compensation. the Baron has other things to keep his eye on currently. 
It takes someone else to bring mm. all of us together. You no price, Ivan. Fair, because you did If you do not have a place on the council, then he has no time to see you. I don't see... I don't see you making any steps to do such a thing. You better watch your... Help Nozos. <laughs> do you remember the promise I made you? Your promise means nothing. Young Lord. Really? Yes. All it takes is one We've letter to your friend's sister. He wants it. What Seer we Neil. require. One fucking letter. And I know for a fact he needs <laughs> people of range. I can provide you that. But only if you meet my she demands. Demands. Yes. Not requests. You should listen to the my voice apology. Keep. keep your mouth shut. When you learn, so shall I. Hmm. My men knows range, and they know how to attack with surprise hmm. behind their backs. They know how to move in the dark, and I train them very well. They're mostly used for reading. And to make things disappear. Arranged. Raiders. Yes. They're good quality. Sounds like a pretty Maybe decent force. Yes. Mm. And to withhold them because this of a lack of an apology, you would do that. Just so I'm establishing. Yes. Mm hmm. And your uh, plans. If I get an apology, I would help. But yeah. if I do not, I will not lend my men. Your plans when the robber baron arrives to the city and sacks it, what then? Just out of curiosity. Well, it's then... Out of curiosity. Hmm. Theoretically. Our business is my own. Hmm. Sometimes it is the little things in life. An apology, eh? Would be easy for you. You have gone up so much in the world, eh? She doesn't want it from me, yes. but I can request them to do so. I don't see why I they know, wouldn't. I listen. Perhaps. And it's him. We're just yeah. looking for a guarantee. And you've told us that you've gone from the very bottom to the very top. Mm hmm Asking someone to bend a knee for a mistake. Well, me. Might be a shock. It is a little price to pay if you haven't. Increase your army. Mm. Well, these are very good points I will make to them. Mm. Good. Mm. good. Despite my apprehension towards this, if there is a guarantee that my losses will be covered with interest, then perhaps I could lend you all that I have. The lady here sells her slaves for one gold apiece. You would be asking for a return of one gold apiece per life lost, essentially. You understand that. With a perception check of a 10, you can tell that the nobles are still somewhat probing you, probing you to see how far they can get away with, or perhaps where you stand. They're starting to understand that you are rigid in your decision making, though some of them you feel will not back down. This woman here, her pride and that of her family has been broken by the former lord, the former baron, unlikely to accept unless given. The noble here seems to be interested in land, perhaps titles. A few places that are currently unoccupied come to mind. Stone mines, iron mines, things of the sort. But you know if you just hand them over, they'll be held to pay later. Perhaps you can get out of it, perhaps you cannot. The situation is tricky. Some want compensation that you know the Radads would never be able to meet unless some sort of middle ground was given. And the largest voice in the room, a mystery. It's clear that she wants coin. But there seems to be a lot more behind the mask, if there even is a mask. She's well-spoken, though she seems sweet and harmless. That's not entirely her reputation. And as you glance to the right, you see the Sahib frowning as can be. Likely looking to undermine you at every turn. The room waits expectantly.
You will ask for things in... Well, not even in return. You ask for these things to even consider lending aid to your baron. You talk of family. You talk of land. You talk of replenishing troops. Favors, things that you want. I need something to give them. You need to earn them. We need to do something. I need to show the barons that this force of slaves, these fighters that we have put together with all of your help, is instrumental to the war effort. When I have something to negotiate with him, I can give you the things that you want. You understand this? Because right now, I'm coming up to them and saying, it'd be really good to have these men, but they want a lot of gold or they want land. It's a lot better for everyone if I can go to them and say, they've done amazing fucking work, let's reward them. Lady knows this? I was just going to agree. Plus, to hear you and I both know all of your men that you have in that camp are not worth a gold. There is no opportunity in any hand that they meet that price. But I'm willing to reimburse you some for your losses. Mm. And I'm sure, Mama, some of your men meet that same standard. Mm. Jahir, you would be a fool to trust mm. Nozos' promises. She does nothing but go back on her own word. Wait, Sahib, you shut your mouth. Your best fighter in, eh? <laughs> Great. If it was not heard before, yes. <laughs> if we can come to an agreement here, all standing, Dredge will lead mm. them. I'll make sure he's on the front line, no hiding in the back. We will stand. For our city, just as anyone else is. Mm. What happens if Dredge gets outnumbered or outmaneuvered because there's not enough men around him? I don't know if we didn't get a full it, agreement of people here. Well, How would that look? Some of our boys and one, unfortunately. Mm. As good as the mm. Imperials losing their diplomats, we look like fools. <laughs> No one and I don't like think we want to be disgraced. Like our invaders, mm. do we? I think we wish mm. to stand mm. higher than them. Protect what is ours, yes? Mm. This is the opportunity to do because so. Because when the robber mm. baron... Hmm. When the robber baron takes over, if he takes over... How do we stand afterwards? We sit here in the Radod's keep. Do you think he will let us live? Do you think he will let us stand? No amount of coin. No amount of coin will pay him off. The truth of the matter is, we're losing this war, and without the assistance of the Imperials anymore, we are going to lose. Unless we do something drastic, unless we do things outside the box, unless we come together and figure out a solution. That is the end of it. So, do we have a solution? If you say drastic, then I will forego some of my desires. But in turn, she gets a guarantee that the two of you will work get an apology from the barons. Do you wish for an apology from both? Or just one? Both. What will suffice? And if we can only get one? One can suffice. It is better than the demand of two. Jahir. In regards. In regards to. It needs the raiding party that I have. This raiding party better be instrumental. No. 
In regards to say that you are having an orc spain, leads this. Despite what you may say about my slaves, they do well in work in cohesion, since they always have team fights. It is what they're known for. You know that well. If you can... It is true, the orc's bane is a powerful fighter, but there are rumors that the Provo champion, the wolf, was bested in combat by this Pasha of the Robber Baron in no less than a single blow. That does not instill confidence that someone less skilled than the wolf would be leading the slaves. <laughs> the wolf, the wolf is, is not my fighter. <laughs> He's fought for you. We've all seen him in the arena under your name. Mm. Employed for show. Mm. If you do not think my fighter could best this man, you are a fool. No, you may already Your be a fool. Your fighter cannot best him already. What reason do I have to believe that the one that is not the champion of the Provo could for some reason? Dredge is as strong as he is for a reason. You do not think that man will fall in front of him. You are making a mistake. And plus, this isn't about one man. This is about Nortes. Making sure we are alive at the end. Do you think one you man will fell well the city? If Dredge is the one to fall, the other slaves will flee like cowards. He will not fall. I will see to it myself. Dredge mm. will be prepared for a fight. Dredge is always no. prepared for a fight. Hmm? I am starting mm. to like the idea that our army might be stronger because of the way we train, eh? <laughs> These soldiers will learn a thing or two. <laughs> <clears throat> I can say that it we is... are more trained with our fighters than the gods are. I can at least vouch as, for that. As I told the young lord, hmm. our fighters are something not to be mocked. They can hmm. stand their own. These men of the robber baron may be many, but there are not as many that are skilled. We have use. Uh, and showing this off to the barons would be rewarded later. Hmm. Nozos, young lord hmm. Erhart. If you can say that Dredge can lead my men, hmm. and there is some recompense of those fallen, whether you threw coin or you happen to find slaves, I don't really care. But... Hmm. It can be done. I will allow them to aid. Thank you, Jahir. Your father is a man of honor. If you truly are his son. I want you to swear upon your name and upon an oath that you will approach the barons and you will guarantee these accolades for us. Do this and you will have my support. The words given are dangerous. You know what that means. That would bind your hands. But they all look expectantly. Wondering what you'll say next. I can't make guarantees that they'll cave, but I can swear and promise to you that I will approach them and I will give it my everything to make them. And then I will throw my support behind you. A dozen mm. good men. My 34 can go ahead. will aid. They work <laughs> in teams. Use them however you want in that regard. As these words are said, Lord Erhard, you look around the room. 
having sworn, in the very least, carefully that you would absolutely bring this to the barons, not guaranteeing the results, but putting your name on the line to do so, the faces of these nobles change slightly. With the support from Nolzus and the careful wording of both an upcoming lord and a former street rat who knows to navigate even the most coiled of vipers' nests. With a natural twenty, everyone in the room falls silent and seems to nod to themselves. And one by one, they agree to your promise, other than the Sahib. Then I have everyone I need. Thank you. Mm. <clears throat> Very well done, Lord Kyla Erdhart. Of course. Well done. To those of you who have pledged their support, I'm sure the future to you looks very what bright. What matter with you all? You are just <sighs> fools falling for these honeyed words. To those of you that haven't <laughs> pledged... You. Honor means nothing to an upstart yeah, like him. To those of you that Ignore haven't him. pledged, your name will be taken down, your reputation smeared. It will be brought to the barons, and it will be spread How through the streets. How dare you, drow? <laughs> You are some fucking nerve. Ah, you've always been a sign of Sahib. That is a lord. <laughs> Unless, of course, you can prove me wrong. Now, I've got places to be, so... Go fuck yourself. Very well. Come, young lord. <laughs> I'm starting to like this, young lord. My lords, I do appreciate all of you. Noses, I'll send some wine. Well, thank you for hosting. Okay. <laughs> I shall send some. You learned right. nothing. Hmm. How could you fall for such petty fucking promises? <laughs> Come on. There he goes. You know Ignore as well as him, I that they will go back on any promises they've given. <laughs> oh, suck on my third leg, Sahib. <laughs> <laughs> the dredge will be Not bad. <laughs> you didn't do bad at all. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Hmm. Don't worry. Sahib's a bastard. Everyone knows it. Not the kind of person I'd want fighting in my army anyway. That's the way I saw it. Hmm. Knowing how he is... Knowing how this city is... Did your father warn you? Of? This place. Things are tumultuous. People just want to get a leg up on each other. Step higher. <laughs> That's just Gradio noises. With... Oh, that I know. But in a state of war, and your father, forgive me, being thought half dead, you are a stepping stone, as much as I am. You'd hmm. be careful to watch your back. Yeah, what else is fucking you? <laughs> Don't brush it off. The number of attacks that have been on me and Dredge were minimal in comparison to what I expect with the number of guard that are out on the field. They will increase. And they will start coming for you too. The Sahib has already threatened me, along with other nobles. Your turn is coming. Yeah. <clears throat> I'll add him to the list. <laughs> him and the other nobles and people from all over walks of life want me fucking dead. Well, at least Mama called you her favorite. At least for now. She's sweet, that one. Ah. Mama can be. Do not let her fool you. She can be a right bitch when she wants to. So how many men is that? Mm. We didn't get Vasahim. Close, close to 60. Close to the number we wanted. 
Hmm. The Sahib's men were useless anyway. That many men could puncture a line if placed correctly. Hmm. What of this one? I'm not sure. Hey, Aka. Hmm. Mm. Oh. She wanted to train with a mace. Um, my knight knows how to fight. I'm willing to offer training if that's okay with you, of course. I didn't want to do anything by no. the back. I have a man of my own. Very well. I suppose the From result the is the trust. same. Yes. Oh, you're gonna learn to use I a will mace see now. no mace in her hand until she is trained. And trusted. Good day. Mm. Good day. Uh, lady, uh, I was approached by a gladiator saying the need to train Akka in um, mace, macery. We were just discussing that. Uh, was I under the impression? All right. <laughs> Nozis has their own person, apparently. So you will not be needed for that. Ah, uh, of course. Right, I wanted to make sure. Uh, that is why I did not uh, handle that. <laughs> right. Mm hmm do not fear. I hope the meeting went I've well. been planning to have them trained in something for some time now, so they're not useless and only hand to hand. You so no interest in maces. It was a man. I said I couldn't make a one without your permission, and you. Yeah. There will not be anything of iron or steel in her hand until I can trust her. Mm. Would to start. Would you like uh, training materials? I have some. Mm. Mm. Tall, long. They're not lethal at all. It's, um... Hilt. A wavy hilt. Rope. <laughs> I have some clubs available in the camp. It is to mm. a teacher what he gives her first and how he trains her. But I have plans. Good. Do you need me for anything else, Lady Gnosis? Not at this time. All right. I'll let you know if anyone approaches me. We'll have to come up with a plan of attack to try and get these barons to apologize, but we can do that later. We can in the later time, yes. Maybe. Marco, <laughs> Marcus. Hmm. Hmm. Hello. Young Lord. Hmm. Keeping out of trouble, Aka. <clears throat> About as well as he doped. <sighs> yeah. You know how they go. <laughs> right. Come on. I think I did okay this time, though. Yeah. Well, you were in the, I'm assuming, solo. No, I just weighed in when she could. Unfortunately, she doesn't have a great reputation with okay. some of them, so her w word didn't have much weight, but I did okay. Right. Going on. Well, while you're away, there's a couple of excursions out and about. Fill me in. You can try. Hey, hear the man out. Let him speak. What now? What's your perfect response to me, Miss Cassidy? I gotta, I gotta do something. Thank you. I don't know that name. What are these excursions? I overheard one of the sergeants filling in the group we know best with uh, Vesrin and the like. I believe they're off to go find... If I, if I remember correctly, let me think. It was a very... It's a, it's a sneak sneak kind of mission. Um, very low level. So it was Vesrin, Marin, Markle, and, and a few others. I know this. I had to get information about the robber baron, I believe. Oh, fuck. We'll see how that goes. Hello. Need what? 
<laughs> uh, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's good. Because I do actually have a fresh stock in. Uh, this is my friend. Oh, my Lord. He's I'll, uh, been... I'll appraise you in a bit. <laughs> <laughs> this is my friend Isaac. He's been helping me get into Isaac, my items when I order them. Hi. <clears throat> Be right back, chat. Let me know if someone comes looking. <sighs> How are we looking? How's the injury? Thumb's okay. I need to change the uh, the bandage in a bit, but it's all right for now.
Evening, Lord. Evening. Don't pressure by the night. Mm hmm. More pressure by the night. <laughs> yep. Backs against the wall now. Morning you hear something, then throughout the day it just surrounds you. The nervousness, everything. I'm too busy to feel nervous. Good way of putting it. Doing what we can to stem the flow. Goodness, just earlier I just made sure that Ladia's courthouse wasn't being broken into. And was it? There's an easy way for some. No, luckily not. If anyone would try to find that place, a good hiding spot for something, especially being right outside the front gate. Hmm. Keep your eyes on it, I suppose. Mm. You have a good night. Mm. Just remember that it's Ellen's people that will be with you. What? I'm, I'm not doing anything. Don't worry about me. There is a oh, knocking the, the, wow. at the door. Stay in. No. <laughs> mm. You'll know what it is. It's it's the lemon candy. <laughs> yes. How may I help you, Lord Arnhart? How are you going with that thing I asked? so painfully formal. Oh, you just didn't, didn't inform me yet? Um, I'm going to try and speak with to? the Guardian. Oh. I'm going to speak with the Guardian tonight. Uh, tonight, I'm going to speak with the Guardian, with Zeph, and with... Um, I'm going to try and talk with the Elder Tree that also... Because they're the only three wisest beings that I know that it could even give me an inkling of what the proper procedure because if I do the wrong thing I don't want to yeah hurt anything no that's fine do whatever you need to do talk to whoever as soon as you can yep okay okay thanks for yeah I'm going, to, I'm going to try and talk to him tonight um Seraphine went to her home to to lay down a little bit I don't know if she's gotten back up yet or not yeah <sighs> thanks for looking after her no, no worries at all. You do the same. If you do see, um, if you do see L, let her know. Okay. Um, I need to. <sighs> if I catch uh, it before him, I'll let her know as well. Is there anything? Is there, oh, um, also, uh, O'Shawn, let me know that I could use the worm leaf that he has. If I can, I'm going to try my best. Uh, I think I have one more. 
rare viscera left. I'm going to try and make that stamina potion. If there's some way you can get that to your father to give him an edge. If he needs an emergency. Yeah, we're working on ways to establish um, supply uh, lines. Uh, connection? Yeah. Okay. I mean, I could probably walk out there with a white flag father. being a medic. They no, they would arrest your ass and take you back to their home and use you to treat them. We went through this before. Don't go out there. Oh, yeah, okay. I gotta be honest, like, bending my knees a bit is, like, just making them ache more, I guess. I guess we'll see how quickly it, like, heals, but, like, you know. Shit, fucking fuck. Stupid fucking goddamn fucking fucking stupid forgetfulness, stupid fucking fog, and stupid out fucking go. <sighs> Yes. Hmm. Well, I may have need for it. I'm uncertain if I can use it. I will let you know. Here's the box. Hmm. How much do I owe you? Uh, fifteen silver, milady. Hmm. Fifteen it is. Oh, oh, there was something else I needed to give you. Um, mm -hmm. Here's two more of those uh, vials uh, for tritons. Ah. How much? Um, uh, there Takes a while to get the right numbers. numbers. Mm. No. One silver each. Fine. Time. Use two of them. Mm. Two silver then. You'll add that to the pile. I may actually have use for one of these. <laughs> Spending time in here too, young lord. Yeah, I need to talk to <laughs> Venora when she's free. Mm. I see. Well, then I will not keep any more of your time. Have a good evening. If there's, if there's anything else you Same. need, my lady, just need to but ask. I shall let you know. Same with you, young knight. Good evening. I forgot to ask, can I get the keys to your house, if you know what I mean? Whatever the fuck that entails. Oh. So I don't, like, you know, forget why I exist for a moment. Because that's kind of I really wonder, unsettling. I wonder if I should take it a wisdom check of is it good to do it in back or is it going to shoot green light? In the I don't fucking know. I don't know how this works. You tell me, Venora. I know. Let me, she, let me, wisdom roll. Time, time <laughs> to yeah, ask a god. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. <clears throat> Wood elves only, fool. Racist. Fucking bitch. Don't dab. 
<laughs> when I come into power. Oh. The new governmental changes. Bozos. Spent 15, 16, 17 silver. What the fuck? <laughs> no comments. <laughs> Stop you people from being able to walk around freely. <gasps> what do you mean by you? You milk oh, drinking sharp it? Oh. Y'all come back to say I'm sorry. I've been. Um. I wore myself out quite a bit in time. It's, it's... Can we probably get her back back in town at the under nightfall maybe easier? Yeah, it seems that the we might be taking you back home, an actual safer home where you have more space to move around. Don't worry about the cleaning, dear. I can handle the rest of it. Yeah, and trust me, there's plenty of equipment there, um, as well that you've used to, to use, and get acquainted with. Yep. Yeah. Much like bigger you. open spaces, so a lot, a lot of stuff to, there's a lot of stuff to do there, so I don't think you'll be ever not wanting to do <laughs> something there where we're going to take you. <laughs> I'm actually very excited. Oh. Hey. Hello. Good to see you, Gordon. Uh, it will be a bit of a walk. Fellow, Wanted to make sure that you got used to your legs touch before with we you, did it. They, they said they were going to get in touch with you and your men and start doing their little divert uh, the robber bear. How are they feeling, by the way? Anything catching up? I've been all over Working with your bowmen and stuff. Actually, everything seems okay. quite good. So I haven't heard anyone well, yet. Well, um, I've been very lucky I gave I them our of stores of wood. They're able to make over I'm 20 punji traps, and they started setting them out throughout the forest. Whenever I go out and about, I notice how she Understood. reacts to loud noises. Um, just to slow them down or yes. deter them from going that route made around. I made something to help with that. Mm -hmm. Should help with yours as well. At this point, anything's going to help. Oh. Nope. We have good numbers out there. The track that we're about to make is more or less one way, but it's safer than here. Trying to finally catch a nod off now, are we, young lord? <laughs> Any few moments of rest I can get at this point. So, so how did the meetings go? <laughs> They're all a bunch of stuck-up fucks, and it took me promising things that I don't know if I can do to get them to even, you know. Water skin. Wow, you're willing to do it already. Thanks. <laughs> this is the second time. Welcome to politics. <laughs> I've had to appease a bunch second of lords, already. and the second time that one of those lords has threatened to, and I quote, run me into the fucking dirt, so... <laughs> look on the bright side, young lord. It gets worse from here. Thanks. Yeah, my What's thoughts funny? exactly... Galil, this is the part where you encourage him, my cards. I, what, what's hilarious, I hate Tyler, he doesn't, he doesn't know you like we know you. <laughs> you can disperse him with ease. That's why people are like, you better be careful, he threatened that. I'm like, you have, you have no idea how, like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they're gonna come to me one day and be like, ah, I'm that person that swore to kill you, and I'm like, do you have any idea how little that narrows it down? Like, I am him. <laughs> I don't. I don't no, think I they realize how how good you really are. Uh, most people assume but... that a noble son is pampered. Mm. Welcome to Gradia. Yeah, I'm built different though. And little do they know you've seen the yeah you've seen the worst of the world has to offer, unfortunately. So you kind of. I don't yeah. think he's ever seen anything like we've seen and dealt with anything. We've Nobility ever from peasantry gives you a different outlook on life. I did use that yes. point, actually. Mm -hmm. I mentioned that I was born in Korakatus. That seemed to earn some respect, but... Hmm. Some people just can't be convinced, okay. so... Fuck them. For, for being a very unknown battlefield, you seem to be doing quite well. <sighs> it's... Why do they see that? Yeah. I'm stumbling my way through it. Out of a, well, out of a, like a one to twenty, there. I got a twenty. 
You know, if I was to rate my uh, my experience, yeah, so that was pretty fun. That was mind. this morning. Well, we all have to start somewhere, from a stumble to a stride. Well, yeah. Yeah. Well, we this Hopefully, you won't have to do it for long, though. There's a full tree. There's an orc. Too. That's hunting. I'd rather be on the front lines and let Arn deal with this. The javelin um, went through that tree, and that tree fell and hit her, and caused the injury. <sighs> because I injured it well, three times. Warning. Oh, whatever it's yeah. doing, it's not happy. And, from what I can tell, it's getting smarter. Speaking of that matter, have you heard rumors? Of? Yes, um... I occasionally go and supply a handful of tinctures for the injured soldiers. They speak once again about the robber baron pushing up further. Mm. There's not really much keeping them from the walls at this point. No, I will think it'll be days before they begin knocking. How common is it for great orcs to have names? Um, not common. Uh, more often than not, there's something of import. That or they've survived oh, that one more than one scrap. Attack guy. Ah. Uh, that's uh, concerning.